my dream bookshop would be just called um, would just be called Language um, or Yaith in Welsh, um, and uh, have a sort of infinite bookshop with all the lang classics of all the languages um, going away to infinity. <laughs> <laughs> um, <clears throat> so uh, uh, certainly Serenity is nice. Um, concept. Uh, comfort, don't put a lot into the heating, um, but I think it's just very important that coming into any bookshop should be a pleasant experience. Uh, ones that are far too crowded I don't like, or piles of books on the floor. I'm almost phobic about piles of books uh, because you, you can't look at them really and you trip over them and things. Um, so as long as it's a pleasant experience, um, you know, whether somebody buys a book or not, as long as it's a pleasant experience, I think that's very important, yeah. Hiya, I'm doing a documentary on bookshops. Um, would it be okay if I was doing some filming in here? Thank you. Uh, you don't film in here. So I don't get a lot of completely new passing trade. Um, quite a lot of students come in sometimes after being here for almost three years and saying, oh, I had no idea you were here, <laughs> which is a bit frustrating. And it's my fault in a way that they didn't know. But um, when they do come in, they do find it an island of um, usually tranquility it can be very busy at times it doesn't seem like it now but uh, I think that's quite an important thing about uh, second hand bookshop is to keep the stock changing because I, I can honestly say there's new stock coming in all the time um, general fiction on the stairs um, Philip Larkin George Orwell similarly I mean, Oscar Wilde I think is, uh, is an excellent writer in the sense that your eye just flows along the line and the page. A cooker socket here on which is attached a piece of string and from downstairs um, you can pull up the end of the string down there and it turns the switch on and in his day uh, there was a kettle plugged in so when he wanted a cup of tea he just pulled the string downstairs and it flicked the switch and um, <laughs> the kettle started boiling so <laughs> they're suddenly becoming more scarce um, when people occasionally say it's the best bookshop in Wales, it, and it's sort of tempered by the fact that they're getting rarer. And uh, um, some of the finest books around. Um, as you can see, there's multiple copies of some things, but uh, of the classics of Welsh literature, uh, Panta Cullen, um, Kate Roberts, um, Edward Tegel Davis. Um, 